First of all, it was a cultural scene, uh, Kerouac and Burroughs, and uh, Herbert Hunky, who was a, was a friend of Burroughs, now a writer, then a hustling junkie on Times Square, who was working with Dr. Kinsey. As Kinsey's informant for the floating population of Times Square, so that Burroughs and Kerouac and myself and Hunky and many friends are integrated into the first statistics of the Kinsey Report. Homosexuality was thought to be a comparatively rare phenomenon until Kinsey came along and provided very good evidence that actually there were, of course, roughly 20 million gay men and women. And that was important. And it was important because it gave great hope to gay people and lesbians because they for the first time realized that they were not a tiny minority, but actually a very sizable proportion of the population. The feeling that was created was you could walk down the street and, oh my heavens, uh, one out of 10 or one out of 20 or whatever it might be, might be having those feelings, might be having those experiences. It really shook people up and made them, uh, it made it impossible for them to think about homosexuality in the old ways, that it was something way over there.